Hello everybody, I'm Fantacore and uh, I'm going to be reacting to another The Spooks video with this one being 5 creepy videos that no one can, could explain. Now as I said this video is by The Spooks and the link to the original video will be in the description box down below if you want to go check out the original video for yourself and possibly any other videos on his channel. And make sure you go subscribe to his channel as well. Without further ado, let's get to uh, let's get straight to the video, shall we? You know, I just realised that I haven't turned the volume up since I was recording these. Hello, everyone. My name is Sir Spooks, and today we'll take a look at five videos that no one could explain. So, let's begin. YouTube channel Raffles Plays Ghost was created by three students of a university in Singapore. As they were interested in ghosts in Singapore, they received an email with a video titled Raffles Plays Ghost. The clip was submitted to them in 2008 by Frederick Tan. The description states the following. He claimed to have been working late one night when he noticed his window blinds moving strangely. Although his office is located in the west instead of the CBD, this video was too sensational to miss. When our team first saw it, we applauded the man for having the guts to capture the whole thing on his camera phone. They also said that it appeared as if something was climbing through. Take a look. Since this video was captured sometime in 2008, you can obviously expect the quality to be pretty bad when captured by a camera phone back then. But nevertheless, it did appear as if something was indeed lurking behind the blinds. Was it a ghost, or was it all just a hoax? It's quite hard to tell from this video alone, which has also left others clueless when it comes to the question of the authenticity of this ghost sighting. YouTube channel Drew Ruiz went with some friends of his to the Purple Church, an abandoned location that was the site of murders and ritualistic sacrifices. The video was uploaded on January 4th, 2009. Yeah, uh, there's one post that I mentioned uh, regarding the previous video clip at number 5. Yeah, um, I think he... He, may have to, he might have had a guts to record it, but that doesn't mean there is any that's crazy enough to stick around to actually record that video proof. And I bet that, uh, I bet you this one at number four. This dude, uh, Drew Ways. I bet he, I bet his video is, is, is still, it's going to be just as creepy as the previous one. Video clip. What's particularly disturbing about this video is that they find two dead animals, including a donkey and a dog. Considering how disturbing the material is, why would you show it here? But I will of course leave links for all videos in the description. Instead, I'll let you listen to the audio of them finding the animals. Okay, here it is. Why would why would he even record a footage of it anyway? It's not a horse, it's a burrow. Look at his head, donkey. Wait. Did somebody kill Eeyore? Somebody killed Eeyore! Okay, whoever killed Eeyore... Oh, oh they're, they're dead now. That, that person's dead. Dude, Eeyore, I've... I, I was had expecting one of them to say Eeyore. I said that Eeyore the donkey. Oh, I hope I'm not the only one who who hope you don't get the weapons. Here's some footage of the abandoned purple church. We're going to see if they've been doing stuff in here since the last time we were here. I 
No, don't go in there. There could be a random person there want to attack it. Don't go in there, you don't tea. There could be someone in there who won't be, who be one, who will be coming for your booty. The, the, the person might wanna, my, the person might want some booty treatment from you. If you get my drift. That dog had no eyes. What kind of dog dies and loses its eyeballs? We gotta go check the horse. Did it have eyes? We gotta go back and see. Looking at the church and its surroundings, it wouldn't be hard to imagine that ritualistic sacrifices could take place there. But the video is still unexplainable because we can't be sure why the dead animals are even there. Were they truly part of a sacrifice, or were they dumped there? Either way, it's very disturbing, and is one of the more unsettling, obscure videos I've been able to find as of recent. Back in May 2007, a ghost was allegedly caught on camera in Waverly Hill Sanatorium. The supposed ghost footage was caught by Matt Monis of the radio program Spooky South Coast. Right after the cameraman says, yeah, they were right about there, man. A figure can be seen at the end of the hallway in the upper right corner. It appears to be watching them only to quickly go back in. Famous hallway from Tenet. Yeah, they were right about here, man. I don't know why, but this video first kind of looks like it could have been from an episode of like Ghost Adventures or Ghost Hunters in a way, if you think about it. Cause, which, which is kind of spooky because cause you know that, they, that, that, that the guys from both Ghost Hunters and Ghost Adventures go looking for this paranormal stuff. Yeah, if you look at the window from what we're sitting right now. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll try my best to enhance this footage. Oh, uh, I can sort of see it. Yeah, you can barely see it. What do you guys think this is? It certainly appears to be a figure of sorts, but whether that figure is a person or an apparition is unknown. And lots of people yeah, seem to I dislike tell. the video, but I think that's because they have no clue where to look for the alleged ghost. Yeah. No one had enhanced it until now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that, that did look kind of hard to, um, that did kind of look hard to, um, see the figure. It, it was, I will not that, that did look really blurry, so it was kind of hard to see the, the figure. I have talked about the Gulf Breeze UFO sightings before, and there are more videos that I think should be shown. This video was captured on May 18th, 1992. What's especially interesting about this UFO video is the fact that luminous material seems to be falling from the underside of one of the UFOs. This happens twice in the video. Take a look. You see it on the monitor? No. He went past it. There you go. Does it look better stopped down like that all the way? No, it isn't all the way. Up in. Is it sit and stand real still, sir? Please, please. Up, 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 sir, okay? Yeah, bulk it. Dude, that, that looks really creepy on almonds. I know, I know. 
wild, man. That was so incredible. I mean, there was stuff coming out of the bottom of it. I mean, that was so weird. The footage was captured by a TV crew from Texas using two professional video cameras. Something that is quite hard to explain is what kind of material is being dropped from the UFOs. In my opinion, this is a very compelling video and one of the best UFO videos I've seen. Yeah, it kind of looked like the UFO in the video is was seen in. Because I, I remember like seeing a couple of UFO videos that, that looked like that looked like the UFO was like dropping like a few things as if it was like seeding or something uh, or something along those lines if that makes sense YouTuber Exploration Unknown who explores abandoned and unusual places went to investigate an abandoned factory According to him, it was a cool explore until they found out that they weren't alone. In the beginning, they hear many noises, which leads them to believe that there are other people in there with them. Approximately eight minutes into the video, a shadowy figure can clearly be seen stepping out from the darkness. Take a look. Somebody's up there banging. Yeah, it's gotta be somebody. Okay, we've got one here to investigate. They are. There's gotta be another one up there. Man, this is creepy, Tim. This is insane. I know. There's got to be somebody in here with us. Oh, there it was. Yeah. He's just got to be. You want to go? Oh, there's an elevator shaft over here. Let's go. That's what I thought. There's one here. Could this be a person trying to yeah, scare them? Or was it someone with more shady intentions? Someone sure. was definitely there, but there's no saying who it was, or what their intentions were. Let me know what you guys think. And that was 5 creepy videos that no one could explain. If you liked the video, then be sure to subscribe for more scary content. My name is Sir Spooks, and I'll see you all in the next video. Well those videos were really spooky. And you can definitely say that they were also really creepy as well. Um, yeah, uh, in case you heard any barking, that, that, that was the dogs downstairs. Um, uh, don't, uh, don't worry about it. It's, uh, uh, it's nothing you're not need to worry about. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, those, those videos are really creepy and, and I will admit, it does seem, it, it's kind of tricky to explain them. Like, like, like that, that one video that, that that one really blurry uh, ghost video that that was really tricky to see whereabouts the ghost was. That that was rather tricky. Yeah, that, that I will admit that 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 does seem really difficult to explain that one. Anyway, um, I hope you all enjoyed the reaction video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and whatnot. Um. The link, a link to this to, to this original video on Sir Spooks' YouTube channel will be in the description box down below. Below, I can promise you all that. And uh, I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. And until next time, goodbye for now.